I'm gonna come out and do some fishing today. Actually, I did for about two hours. I haven't caught a thing, which is just about normal. So I really didn't get to record any good catches or anything. So I thought I'd take this opportunity to show you the most insane upgrade I've ever done to my boat. That would be the Ultrax Minkota Ultrax Trolling Motor. And there's so many uh, features that's hard to show you in just one video. So I'm gonna show you my favorite one, or my two favorite ones actually. Uh, the first one is uh, spot lock, which it's in right now. And what it's doing is it has a GPS lock on our position. And I've been sitting out here for about 20 minutes getting my camera ready and putting all my rods and reels up and everything. And uh, just put it on spot lock and we haven't moved it, haven't moved an inch. And um, no matter how hard the wind is blowing or what's going on it's going to do everything it can to keep you in a locked position and that's really coming in handy uh, especially when I fish by myself because a lot of times the wind's really blowing hard if you have to stop and do something you just hit that spot lock and it'll keep you in the one spot uh, you know if you need to retie or take a fish off or whatever you need to do if you ever need to stop fishing and be off the trailer motor for any length of time you can just hit that spot lock stay in one spot and then resume fishing uh, whenever you get your you know sort out what you're doing the other feature that I, that I like is my number two position uh, my num my number two reason that I like this trailer motor so good is because uh, my uh, depth finders and my trailer motor communicate with one another so I'm able to hit a waypoint on my depth finder and then tell the trailer motor to go to the waypoint and circle it and that's really neat because when you're trying to fish a brush pile or something you, you, you mark one on your depth on your depth finder and then you can go back and just your boat will actually just circle around that waypoint you can choose how far you want to circle around that waypoint but you can just sit there and fish that waypoint I guess forever uh, without even touching the trailer motor so it makes it really nice. Uh, you don't have to worry about running the trailer motor as much. Uh, you can concentrate more on fishing. So I'm gonna demonstrate that right now. So I'm sitting way over here again on spot lock. And way over there is a buoy way off in the distance. And when I was coming by, I set a waypoint on that buoy. Uh, number 150. So what I want to do now is tell my trolling motor to go pet. I want to tell my trolling motor if you can see this. Everything's so bright out here, I can't see. I'm going to my, tell my trolling motor to go to waypoint 150 and circle around that waypoint. So we hit go to circle that cursor that's where my cursor is on that waypoint way out there clockwise be fine and then from there you gotta hit this just hit the go button so it's taking this this waypoint way over there then you can adjust the speed if you need to. And you can see on the trailer motor here, on the depth finder here, it shows that it's approaching that circle, that waypoint, where the 50 foot circle is. It shows we're approaching it. So that buoy is my waypoint. And the trailer motor just veered off. Takes it a minute to adjust.
And then you can set your speed at whatever you want to circle at. So right now we're circling at a speed of five and we're at a 50 foot radius of the waypoint. The waypoint again is that buoy out there. And then you can track your progress on the screen while you're while you're fishing. So you can do all this. You can fish, run the trolling motor, or you can you can fish without having to run the trolling motor. You can just continue to circle the waypoint until you decide otherwise. I found it to be pretty much invaluable to, when you're fishing. Such a great upgrade to your boat. You can see there. It just does it all automatically, straight off a of waypoint. Suck around that buoy there. That's pretty much as handy as a pocket on a shirt, if you ask me, especially if you fish by yourself a lot. If you like to fish deeper brush piles and stuff like that, uh, it's pretty much invaluable. I found it so useful. When I'm out fishing, you know, you run across a little brush pile or whatever with your, you know, your depth finder, you can just mark it, and then tell you, tell your trolling motor to go back to that point and just circle around it and you can fish it. So you know, you're fishing deep brush piles or drop offs or anything where you mark fish, you can go back and fish it easily. So if you're thinking about doing an upgrade to your boat. I would highly suggest the Minn Kota Ultra X. They have several models, GPS uh, trail motors now, but I would definitely suggest getting one if you're serious into fishing. That's all for today. Thanks for watching. See you on the next one.